Hi you guys, so today I am going to share with you a haul that I got from Sephora and Ulta. Um, I'm really excited about it. I don't do a lot of hauls, but this was a really fun shopping day because Ulta actually had just done all their inventory and put out some of their holiday items that they had this past Christmas. And it's March, so I was like, dang, this is awesome. So it was kind of fun because there were a lot of stuff was discounted. So I just wanted to share that with you. And then also, um, Sephora had some holiday stuff too, which I thought was pretty unusual. It was a, it was a lucky day for me shopping. So um, I'm going to start with my Sephora stuff. I did get a ton of stuff at Sephora. But um, <clears throat> starting off, I'll just start off with my normal. I always, I just kind of needed to restock on this Ultra Repair Cream. started using this a couple months ago for um, a face cream. And it is awesome. I, I can stick it in my purse and I can use it as like a hand lotion. And then it doesn't clog my pores or cause blackheads or anything like that. So sometimes, especially in the morning or in the night, when I've taken off my makeup, I like to put on lotion and then put it on my face. Um, I live in Utah and it's a really dry climate. So I live and breathe by lotion and moisturizers and anything hydrating. So this is a really great um, face moisturizer if you're wanting to find a new one. Um, also, let's see, I picked up, I've always wanted to try Bite, their lipsticks and that whole beauty line. Um, every time I've tried on Bite, I, I thought it was really pretty. It's a little bit more on the high end pricey side, so that's why I haven't invested in it yet. But at the checkout, I am obsessed with looking at little travel size, um, you know, items and merchandise and things like that. So I was checking that out and I found this dual sided um, lipstick and I thought, why not try it? And I loved it so far. Um, there's two colors. It's Fig, which is one that they carried at that Sephora as a staple. And then there's Date. And so I didn't see Date there, so it might just be like a, a seasonal color or something like that. But I have Fig on right now and I really like it. As you can tell, it's just like a very um, kind of a light color, but it's very hydrating. So if you want um, something that's hydrating and gives you a little bit of color, this would be a great um, great one to try. And I think their packaging is actually pretty cute. It's, it's very like, I don't even know the word for it, but it's very like uh, modern and clean and their little logos right there. So, so it's dual ended, but very, very cute. So trying that out. So far, so good. I also went into um, Sephora to get the um, Stila's Stay All Day Waterproof, or yeah, Waterproof Liquid Liner. It's more of like a marker. Um, I'll pull this out for you so you can see. I like to use Maybelline Stiletto Liner to get um, winged eyeliner and get a little flick, but I thought if I could get one that's more of like a marker, that it would be easier to get that flick on the... Um, the wings of my eyeliner. So, so far I like it. I have it on today and I really, really like it. Um, and then also at the checkout, I found a little holiday gift set that Stila had. It's Holiday Essential Kit and it's really, really pretty. Um, I'm wearing all of these in my old Hollywood glam hairstyle tutorial. Um, sorry, I'm kind of getting over a little bit of a cold, but it has a mini little eyeliner like the one I just bought. Um, that's the Stay All Day Water proof um, liquid eyeliner. Then it has an eyeshadow called Kitten, which is really pretty. It's just a soft, shimmery, kind of neutral, lighter color to go, you know, all over your lid or just on the inside corners. It's really pretty. And then there's this um, Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick, which is a really pretty reddish orange. Um, and it dries as a matte, so stays really great when you're eating or drinking or anything like that. So it's very, very pretty. Um, even though it's March, I know I'll wear it a lot through the summer and different things like that. I love wearing red lips. It's one of my staples. And then also I'm excited for, you know, Christmas time and holiday parties, which is not for a long, long time. Fourth of July. We're at Fourth of July coming up in a couple of months. So anyway, that's Sephora. And then um, at Ulta, I originally went in there because I was watching a YouTuber who said that she really likes the Pixel eyeliner for the, um, like the liquid eyeliner and that it was only like six dollars so I went into Ulta looking for it and Ulta has discontinued Pixel and I was like what I want to try it all I had left is green everybody had bought the black and the purple and the blue they had green and I thought that might be pretty I was thinking it was a hunter green and it is like poison ivy hulk teenage mutant ninja turtle green 
So I really highly doubt that I will be wearing this on a normal basis. I can maybe wear it for like St. Patrick's Day or something coming up. But other than that, I think I'll just keep it for like my, my Halloween makeup. So it's also really hard to get off. I tried to I tried it on and tried to get it off and it was just like staying, staying, staying. It's like a tattoo, I swear. Um, then I wanted to try out NYX. I really like um, NYX, their, the, a lot of their different products and I thought I'm just going to try out their lipsticks because I'm a lipstick junkie. Um, the first one I'm, try, I'm trying out is Siren. It's a really dark kind of grapey purple and I know this is a weird time of year to buy that color but... I don't know, it just stuck out to me. I have Max Hang Up, which is a really dark Bordeaux color, but it's really shiny. It's a satin finish, and I really wanted more of a matte. So I'm trying that one, um, and I feel like I can get away with it for the next couple weeks because it's still springtime. And then my staple lipstick color that I always wear is more of like a mauve color, and so I wanted to just find some that are a little bit less expensive or on the you know drugstore um, accessibility, easy to get. And so this one is... Um, 565, five. it's more of that mauve kind of natural color. So I'm excited about those. I think that, that'll be fun to try out. They don't really have like a heavy smell or anything like that, which I like. Um, I like MAC's lipsticks where they smell more like vanilla, but I don't really like my lipsticks to smell like anything like, very much. So also I got a bunch of like coppery colored, um, this is like a liquid shadow from NYX as well. Super pretty. I'm excited to try it. Um, and then I also got this from Essence. I think Essence might be... A lot of the Essence stuff was discounted at Ulta as well. So I thought this would be pretty as like a bottom eyeliner. Just on that bottom like your water well or something like that. So I'm excited to, to try those out. And then I got just like a little sharpener. And then um, I was really excited because like I said I like looking at all the little um, travel size items at the checkout. And I found an EOS stick. I was so, so excited. Because I love EOS. I have like a bunch of the EOS balls and things like that. And I love um, the formula. I love how it smells. I love everything about it. And so finding a little stick was exciting. Because it gave me a reason to buy another chapstick. This is probably my favorite flavor. is the raspberry pomegranate or the pomegranate raspberry. I always get it mixed up. So... They had it in that flavor, mint, and vanilla. Very exciting. Okay, then on to the holiday package things. Um, I love to do pedicures. Like, I love to, you know, you know, relax at nighttime and soak my feet and paint my nails and things like that. And then also, I always end up doing, like, my sister's nails or my mom's or my niece's. Sometimes we just have, like, nail parties at my parents' house when we visit on Sundays. So I've been really wanting, a, like, a little pedicure thingy with dingy. And they're normally around like $25 or $30, but I went into Ulta and it was on sale for $15. So I snagged this baby. I was so excited about it. Um, and then also I got a couple of holiday gift makeup sets for my nieces. My sister Holly is probably going to like die. But my nieces love to play in her makeup and so I thought these would be really cute and they were only $6. So... Um, that's all that I got from Ulta and Sephora. So thanks for watching. If you liked, if you like hauls, give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.